The charred remains of 21-year-old Jamalski Young were recovered on Sunday night on mile 8 of the George Price Highway. Young, who lived in Ladyville, died after the motorcycle he was on burst into flames after being knocked down by a white pickup truck. Police said that when Young was driving past a Blue House bar, a white pickup truck reversed into him. Young's brother, Keenan Young, told Love News that minutes before his death, Young left home on his way to Sky City Supermarket, where he had been employed for about eight months. The last time I seen my brother, the last night, must like quarter to nine when he said he went to work. And we received a phone call that an accident gone on from the Northern Highway. And when we talked to my brother, he said, I want a white pickup reverse on the car now. Uh, you see it by seeing but it's still, still the bonnet, it's still the bonnet. The driver of the vehicle fled the scene, leaving Young to burn to death. Residents attempted to douse off the flames, but it was too late. The motorcycle was on fire, and then, my, and then she went and ran to my brother and told him what was going on. So my dad, my brother, and my sister like, came out with buckets of water trying to ease the flame, and the, the chariot from the other side, he came also and helped, and that was what is done everything because no fire department then came, nothing whatsoever. So that was practically, and they, they know the man was there, they, all they were trying to do that is done the, the flame. Everybody thought it was the motorcycle because that like oh, that was bigger, so that was what you can see, but we didn't expect that for him to be there. Love News understands that police have located the vehicle, but not the driver, who is suspected to be a foreign national. What type of individual was your brother? Uh, a nice person, a friendly person, you know, make you laugh. Every day he come up and work and us make we laugh. What message would you have, you know, for that driver? I don't know what I left that for God. God not asleep. I mean, I left that for God, right? Every weekend, I have a lot of cars and a lot of people out there. When you go out, they going to ask him who said no one you want to talk. So we also left it to God, right? Young leaves behind one child while another one is on its way. Reporting for Love News, Hippolyta Novello.